Hi, welcome to the MuleSoft Tutorials. This is Akash and in this video we'll use SMTP connector and we'll try to send one mail from one of my Gmail address to my another Gmail address. So currently for this tutorial I'm using my Google account but you can use any of the accounts, any of the mail server you want. So to start with I will go and create one new project. I will say gmail proj I click on finish so this will create my gmail project and there's one gmail proj.xml file what I will do I will drag one http listener for http as an inbound so it will be http listener I will click add will click on ok here I will let's say my path is email I will save it and then what I will do, I will drag one SMTP connector. Okay, so the body of end of the email will be my payload. So before SMTP connector, I need to set one payload. I will set payload. So in this payload, we can give MIME type as any of we want. XML HTML so let's say I want to give text HTML so I will write my content of the body hi user comma br is the break line in HTML let's say this is test mail br thanks Br Akash. Yeah, so this is my email body, and I will configure now my S SMTP connector. So host will my be smtp.gmail.com for Gmail. The port number is 587. Username is the username from where I want to send the mail. Let's say I'm using my one of my dummy mail rn007 at the rate gmail.com and the password of that and here I will do the configuration so I click on here so if it is gmail.com I'm using I will use gmail dot gmail connector if I'm using any other SMTP I will use SMTP so right for now it's gmail so click on gmail okay so here I will write BCCs if you want to add any BCC or uh, want to add some carbon copy to CC we'll add address over here content type will can have text HTML from address from address is Akash RAN007 at the rate gmail.com and reply to addresses same Akash RAN zero zero seven at the rate gmail dot com and subject is test mail we can write subject over here or else there's one more thing where we can write the subject over here so let's say I want to send this mail to my different email address which is akash dot ranglani at the rate gmail dot com from address akash rn007 at the gmail.com subject is test mail cc bcc and reply to reply to will be the same as akash rn007 at gmail.com so i'm done with the configuration part we'll save this project and we'll try to run it run as new project So for the first time when you when you will try uh, to send a mail you will get some exception so for that we need to provide privileges to send the mail from a gmail account so you will get this type of mail access for less secure app has to be turned on so we'll click over here and uh, I will go and 
as you can see this is some apps uh, our devices are signed in technology so just just click turn on update it we cancel this we click over here again now we'll try to send the mail so it's deployed successfully we'll hit from a look some so we'll say local host 881 slash email enter let's see so got um, started starting i think yeah this is the mail i want to send this is the this is in payload and here i can check my okay here i got a mail test email hi user hi user this is the test mail akash okay so when i will click on hi got it so this will reply to this man this is the same email address so in this way we can configure our smtp connector according to our need so currently i'm using gmail so i i selected the gmail if i want to use some other let's say i want to smtp i can click on smtp and click on ok and then here i need to provide all the details and here in host host should not be smtp or gmail.com if you are using yahoo the host will be different and port will be different or if you have your own email server you can configure over here so in this way you can uh, send uh, emails from your Microsoft project or api so this type of things will be useful when uh, when a user wants to receive some mail let's say some exceptions are coming on exceptions are coming on some api so we'll add that smtp in exception handling so every time exception is coming we'll get the mail so maybe you can practice this thing on your local system and yeah if anything doubt just ping me or just drop me a mail which i have provided on the first slide okay so thank you for thank you for this i think that's it for the, this video See you soon. Bye.